Okay, so today I'm trying out a new e.l.f. glitter eyeshadow. You know I'm obsessed with all things glitter, and the glitter eyeshadows by Stila and NYX have been killing the game, so I thought I'd give this e.l.f. one a try. Now, this is in color Disco Queen. When I saw it, I was like, come to mama, okay? Don't judge, tanning mishap. I almost said not my fault. Totally my fault, but we're with it, okay? So we're gonna try this out. I'm gonna swatch it first to see kind of so it is a really beautiful glitter, but doesn't seem like it's a solid pigment on its own. So we might need to do a look where this kind of goes on top. So let's get started. Okay, so first things first, we're gonna go in with our base, Tarte Shape Tape, you know is my fave. And we're just gonna pat that on to give us a clean canvas to work with. You know, bitch looks crazy. Now we're gonna go in with our transition shade. I'm using Raw Sienna from the Anastasia, Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. Just like a nice neutral brown. We're gonna put that on both of our lids. Oh, it needs to have a color under it, but I tried it with this one and wow. Like it just makes any matte color really pop. So I think I'm gonna go a little ballsy today and get a little crazy, even though it makes me a little nervous because I tend to stick to like gold and neutral colors. But there's this really beautiful like purpley pink color that I've been wanting to try. And it's winter, so I feel like it's like the time. So we're gonna just go for it. So I'm just gonna put this on my lid right in here. Wow, that is a really beautiful color. I really like that. Okay, so this is from my Morphe, uh, Morphe palette 35B. Um, and it is just, these colors are just super gorgeous. I love it. Okay, so we're gonna place this on both lids. And really just kind of pat it in and then we'll go over with the glitter okay let's showcase this bad boy disco queen i mean the name alone has me feeling some type of way so it has like a flat head applicator i'm just gonna pop it in here see what it does to this pink color mm, it's kind of clumpy actually more than i was hoping so it's a really, really beautiful glitter. I don't know if it works well with this pink though. Because it has kind of the bluish purple undertones it looks like. So let's kind of do a subtle amount. Let that dry, see what happens. We'll finish this look and we'll decide. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with like this combination right here and just kind of add it to the corner. Kind of blend it out. We'll see what this bad boy does. See how we feel about this look. Wow. That's all I can say. Wow, bitch. Normally these are not my go-to colors, so it always feels a little more dramatic when you're not used to like the look. Even though I do like the way it makes my eyes look, so. Okay, so we're gonna blend this out a little more. And then I'm gonna kinda go in with a little bit of this black with a little bit of glitter here, just in the corners to kinda accentuate that little C right here. And then we'll blend it out. Blend it, blend it, blend it, blend it. That is kind of always the game. How much do you need to blend a lot or a little? Which with this look, Wow. Okay, I lied. I just cleaned off the brush that we were using and now I'm just gonna kind of go in and really blend out that crease right here. So it's not so intense, even though if it wasn't the middle of the day, <laughs> like a night out look, this actually would be really, really fun. So, okay. I'm actually really liking this more than I thought I would. Now, the glitter itself has kind of settled into the eyeshadow and I like it more now than I did when I first put it on because I just felt like it didn't blend very well, which obviously with greens, blues, whites, I feel like this glitter would really kind of make it pop, but I do think it adds like a nice little extra zhuzh, that's what I keep saying. Okay, now we're gonna go back in with our neutral brush and just kind of blend out this. Okay, so I'm gonna finish out the look and then I'm gonna come back and I wanna know what you think. Do we think this glitter was amazing, mediocre? Throw it in the trash. 
Okay, finished look. Threw on some eyeliner. The glitter is very settled now. I really like it actually. I think you just have to kind of like let it fully dry. Um, but I'm definitely gonna try it on some other colors. What do you think? Should we keep toss or just try it with maybe some more blues, whites, silvers kind of vibes? 